Hi guys, welcome back. This month's Digital Dozen Nail Art Challenge theme is all about December. So of course I have some Christmas themed nail arts. This first one I have is holly leaves or holly berries. And I'm using three colors from the Pretty Serious Ghosts of Christmas Past collection. Um, first I have on my nails this pretty silver that is called Berry Lights. And I'm gonna try stamping with the red and the green which are Velvet Bow and Enchanting Evergreen. And I'm using the new Uber Chic Beauty Christmas O2 plate. This is super adorable. There are so many cute designs on here. I love the Santa with his reindeer sleigh. I love just the, the dots there for falling snow. That is like so helpful because I hate making dots with a dotting tool. I love this Christmas tree and these ornaments will be super cool with um, like decal designs. So many cute images. I love this with the little reindeers and stockings. And my favorite part about this plate is these couple layered stamps that we have here. I'm going to be using these layered holly stamps. We have the leaves on one side and the berries on the other side. So you put the leaves down first and then put the berries down in another color. You can also probably do this with those um, candy canes above. For the leaves, I'm gonna use Enchanting Evergreen. I don't know how well this will stamp because it is um, it's kind of a like sheer base. So let's see. Mm. No, this does not work for stamping. So let's try from Pretty Serious Ghosts of Christmas Future Collection, which was last year's holiday collection. We're gonna use Hack the Halls. And a little trick that I do sometimes to tell if it's gonna work for stamping is if you pull the brush out of the bottle a bit and kind of scrape it along the edge of the neck and you can see when the polish drips back down in, if it coats the neck and doesn't like show through, usually it'll work for stamping. So this seems like it should be good. Much better pick up on that one. So step one, have the leaves down. And I'm gonna go do the berries with velvet bow. And I knew this one would work. This is a much more opaque red. Now this one. <laughs> I didn't realize how difficult it would be to line up the second stamp with the first one. This is kind of tricky. I should have paid more attention to where the top and the bottom of when I picked it up. But bear with me, let me try to find it. I think that looks good. Yeah, that looks about right. Yeah. <laughs> this is really cool though. I. I know there's some other brands that have done these um, layered stamps before, but I don't have any of those plates. So I was really excited to get this one and to try it out. And I'm also using HK Girl top coat that I got at um, PolishCon. I hadn't tried their top coat for a few years, like way back when they first started making it. This is my first time using it again. I really like it. It doesn't smear my stamping at all. Anyways, super simple design today. I hope you guys like this. Please let me know in the comments what you think. As always, like, subscribe, share, all that stuff. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.